Hi, I'm, uh, I'm Dan Welling. I am the project officer for IDEA, the International Debate Education Association. Uh, and I'm here in Kanska Gora, Slovenia, where we are hosting an international youth exchange for 15 countries, uh, which is a fantastic opportunity for 150 participants to learn about each other's culture through the ways of learning debates and learning critical thinking. I think it's important that in European projects, people learn about each other and about other themes. I think that our current youth are some of the most engaged young people that I've ever seen. I think therefore that having the opportunity for them to teach them how to express those thoughts in the best possible way and to have them think about many critical topics such as climate change, refugees, labor unions and also the European Union, how it works, how it affects their lives is critical for them to get their best for the future but also to help all of us when they become the next leaders tomorrow to learn about that. Um, what is the specific of this program from a teacher's point of view or from a point of view of a debate coach or educator or, or an educator is that we are trying to connect different perspectives of an education for youth people. A, education in rhetorics, argumentation, critical thinking on one hand and education in specific content. So that means that through the form of debate, through the form of argumentative engagement on different topics, we are trying to address content, issues, problems connected with European unions. The point, uh, the unique characteristic of this event, as I see it as an educator, is that on one hand uh, we give them some critical thinking tools with which they can engage with the content. With, uh, on the other hand, we give them some theoretical approaches, so some theoretical, sociological, philosophical backgrounds through which they can access the information. And lastly, we give them a lot of information Information, a lot of knowledge and after having these three things each day they then in the end engage in an actual debate on a topic when they practice and probably especially this multidisciplinary or interdisciplinary approach is something that is lacking in the current educational system across the Europe it's something that is um, adding a lot to uh, youth active and global citizenship and their cultural sensitivity uh, and is also uh, something that is uh, making uh, students much, much more socially and politically engaged in, uh, in current, uh, uh, current political, social and even personal struggles. Because the majority of the judges, just a second, do write down the PYs, okay? Yes. Um, I'm going to talk about a little bit about my impression of these workshops. Well, first of all, they were really helpful. Um, I really enjoyed um, making them. They were really um, interesting. I learned a lot, and, uh, the, and the, um, the cultural diversity that we had here was really impressive as well. I, I met lots of people, lots of new countries, and lots of new um, cultures, and I got to um, get to know more about them, which was really interesting. Today, yesterday, we had a lot of workshops, and uh, the one I liked the most was about um, the different political, uh, democratic political uh, systems within Europe, and uh, I found it really interesting, and I'm uh, enjoying my time here. Hi, I'm Sami, I'm from Belgium, and me and my friends love Slovenia because of the beautiful mountains that we don't have in Belgium. Uh, we love also the workshop, uh, we were in the media team, uh, we made a beautiful short movie and some uh, good interviews and uh, we hope you guys like them. Thank you. I learned a lot of things of debate and I think that the most important workshop is the the workshop about the cultural diversity because I live in a world that there are a lot of migrants in every country and I think that is very very important. Thank you. Hello, I'm Maria, I'm 16 years old and I'm from Bulgaria. What I really don't enjoy as many people in this event did was the, uh, was the united diversity. Actually, my pr brilliant team made it to the finals and right now we are waiting for the result of the last debate of today. Uh, on, and the motion was about nationalism. We were in the opposition, so we, our uh, 
um, our aim, our purpose was to prove that nationalism does more good than harm. I'm glad I'm here. I'm glad I'm uh, so the beautiful country of Slovenia. I'm here for the first time. I fall in love with those mountains, with the lake, um, with the city we visited, and with those people I've met here.